Hi dudes, it is Saturday, it is, oh no, don't stop the Rustyville. No, sorry, sorry. Uh, yeah, okay, Rustyville, we're at the British Motor Museum at Gay. I apologise, folks, he gets worse. No, I can get a lot worse, yeah. Um, yes, yeah, so, we're here. Uh, we're in Mayfair. And the total mileage so far is 159 miles. Don't ignore what it says on the trip because I forgot to trip it before we set off. But we're still just over half in fuel. Topped it up before we set off, we're just over half. It was a good run down, it was quite slow and careful. We haven't got a lot of choice because bloody road works most of it. That's the government's uh, quick death campaign on the motorways. Oh, I did, where were they? I forgot yeah, to Yeah, so we we'll just, we'll just trottled down. Yeah, anyway, we're, uh, we're here now. So. We could turn. If you turn that off. <laughs> Bloody hell, it's gone quiet. It's gone deaf. <laughs> <laughs> right. So, you, so you're now deaf and blind. Deaf and blind, yeah. I know it's bugged. I've turned lights off on you. Yeah, yeah, remember me in the toilet, just getting dressed and I went dark. I thought, oh, I've gone you. blind. They were right. No, apparently she put the card out at the blooming thing in the room. It's true. I thought, so, I'll was, take was card out. Was somebody missing there? <laughs> oh, I'm by myself, it doesn't really matter. I thought, I'll take card out and put it in my purse and then I won't forget it. Forgetting that you were in the bathroom. Yeah, I'm in pitch. <laughs> Anyway, never well, mind. We're, we're, we're going to have a look around other cars at the cars in Rustyville now. It was an early morning. <laughs> so we need a coffee. Right, we'll see you in a bit. And a very good morning again from Rustyville 2. Oh yes, here we are. This is it. We're in the um, Vanden Pla section. I'm with the Riff Raff in Mayfair. So we'll start with the organisers. And then we're going to look at some cars. There's a lot of cars. So we're going to have to <coughs> be selective. Right, let's crack on. Here's Hubnut Stand. There's Miss Hubnut. Oh, you're doing some crowning. <laughs> oh, you're going to do the... That's the Monday, huh? Yeah? So, okay. I'm not always coloring in with yet, so I'll have to wait. You're going to have to get some, yeah. But you've got the important bit, you've got the sweets. Yeah, of course, I've got that one. <laughs> you've got the bounty. Right, next door we've got Furious Driving. It is. And there's got lots of merch. I think they're sharing the merch. I Drive a Classic, that's Steph from I Drive a Classic. A nice little stall. Right. Okay, now this is the creator's section where um, meet the, the creators, the YouTube creators usually. Right, anyway. Now tidy, there's a wandering organist. So there. Of course, you recognise this one. This is a Zool Zero garage, and there he is. Is Mondeo. We have a Volvo, Rover, oh sorry, MG. Now this is the um, refurbishment stand. There was Steph, I drive a classic working for now. Right. Honda, hmm. That's the, the wheel trim shady. Well and deaf. You should drive one of them. <coughs> That's unusual. Don't know what it is, so I'll crack on. Right. Down here, Series 3. At least I think it's a Series 3. It's got the lights in the wings. Oh, is it a 2A? I don't know. Tell you what, that's quite nice. Right, down here. Let's have a look at Bob. Here's Bob, look. Bob is an excellent F-Ridge 
escort. Yeah, minis, um, beamers, marinas, <laughs> masters. Uh, right, um, 2.6 Amiga. Beautiful, absolutely stonking. Had an Amiga, brilliant cars. Mmm, twin cam V6. Bloody marvellous. The only problem was once it went wrong, couldn't afford to fix it. Tell you, we passed by one of those coming up motorway. Um, ah, Wartburg. When's the last time you saw a Wartburg? With a Skoda park next to it. Yep, Alpha, Pima. Oh, nice bench, I want that micro. That's nice. Well done. Fuel power. That's a nice Nova. Um, I need to have a address that paintwork on the bonnet. It's a beautiful Rover P5. Oh, is it 90? Mmm. <laughs> yeah, too much polishing, rub paint off. <laughs> right, Furious Driving's Crown Vic. Is that? Really marvellous. <laughs> right, um, Freelander, one. Oh, okay. Right, Porsche. Panda. Corsa. Something. Right, Scotchy, Scottish car enthusiast and trains TV. We've seen him once or twice already. He's staying in the same hotel. Brilliant. This man deserves our accolades. He's driven down from Edinburgh to Warwick in that. Top man, absolute top man. Right, Hubnuts um, Berlingo. The old multi space or multi space. Not to say they're quite roomy. So we've got the Bilingo, Bell of the Bilingo, and the Giselle, which is looking mint. Absolutely shiny. Oh, flipping, eh? Made a lot of detail, wasn't it? I'll tell you what, that's a top job. Right, then we've got um, Fiesta, Suzuki, Audi. <laughs> right, Rover. Gonna have to speed up. Another Rover. Right, this is the Moggy Miners uh, Ensemble. I like this one, this paint works similar to mine. Right, um, yep. We saw um, one of the Moggy Miners at Gilks Cafe last night. Uh, now I've got a Twingo, you don't often see a Twingo. Cavalier, mm, lovely, lovely. And Vectra, Vectra Estate, where did Vectra Estate? Mint, loved it. Look okay, out, Clarkson says, I liked it. Um, Maxi, lovely Mini. Another Mini, um, Merc, oh yeah, that's nice. Just uh, Peugeot. Oh, it's a beautiful Capri here, three litre V6. I 
Mint. Oh, chuffy mint. Yeah, don't touch him. Okay. Yeah, 3 litre GT. Didn't know they came with such a big boot spoiler. Right, next door we have a Pulsar. Oh, I have no idea either. Pulsar. Right, okay. Over here, um, Kev T. And, yeah. Don't know. Not, uh, not watched his channel. Fixing cars one step at a time. Okay. Oh. Fixing old crap ones the ass at a time. <laughs> so, we all do that, don't we? Um, TV detective van. Sirocco Rover SD1. And then our bath. That's nice. Van den Plaat. Right, we'll go down here. Um, there's a transit motorhome here, it looks pretty ropey, to be fair. Um, okay. Yeah, the sides are bulging. Anyway, never mind, there's a Range Rover Classic next to it. Very, very nice. Range Rover Classic. Uh, yeah, long going project, three and a half V8, twin Strombergs, long stick five speed unit. Well, that's nice, I like that. Always did like a classic. Right, ca crack on. That's a nice green. <laughs> and Jack, um, and Riley 1.5. VW Saab. Oh, that's a nice focus. Audi, Audi. G Wagon. Um, must be some Russian oligarchs here. Um, Mazda. Yeah, there'll be a good reason for that. Mini. Ah, right, here we go. Look. Astra. 93 Astra. Merit. Absolutely blooming gorgeous. Yeah. Right, well. This must be straight out of a museum. I cannot see any rust at all, well, apart from those spots, there we go, because the rubber buffers. And he's got two gar double gar fields. Oh, flipping heck. Yeah. It's well, a merit. I've bought two other cars, I'd quite like him to buy that and the Focus as well. Sam, I think you'd suit the Focus. Stop to the vlog of the bloody Focus. Hello, Sam. Sam, how are you? <laughs> Right, crack on. Um, yes, um, one of them. Ah, uh, uh, Mustang. Mustang. Okay, Alpha, Citroen, uh, Talbot. Is that a uh, Lotus Talbot? Not any old Talbot. That's a Lotus Talbot. Um, yes. Or a Moggy Mine uh, and uh, Tinukasaurus. Okay. I can honestly say I've not seen anything like that for a while. Right. Um, let's cover this row. This is just the Van den Pla section, is this? Got some toy stalls. Excellent Volvo. <laughs> yep. That's quite a tall vehicle, isn't it? For a Renault, a Renault Kangoo. 
Yeah, I thought, you know, I thought that was a Mondeo. And it's a Hyundai. No sign of any copying going on there then. Now for... Yeah, we're looking at an engine, we're looking at another engine. I think that's a cool, that's the car we saw last night at Gilks, which was a lovely experience, I've never been there before. Right, this is the Rosas, they've turned up in force. Three of your best Crown Vicks. Bad boys, bad boys, what are you going to do? And police car and a police car. And then we've got a fire engine, so just in case we spontaneously combust, we can be put out by the fire engine. And next to that, we've got a bus. A big bus. A, a Leyland bu big bus. Which, frankly, I still think these are new. So how old am I? <laughs> right, so that's, the, that's this section. Now we'll go to the other section. Ah. Nearly walked past this. Yeah, it's a Peugeot. It looks like a 207. And suddenly, hang on a minute. Somebody's cut the back off. Well, the, it turns out to be a Peugeot Hogar. Oh, it's a Hogar Escapade. Right. Don't care, that's just cool. Probably impractical, but still cool. It's from San Paolo. That's where you get photographed on the way in. If you want the photo, that's where you get the... Um, uh, print from. Uh, there's obviously some hot dog stones which is extraordinarily good. Alright, okay, we've got a Volvo and look at this. Oh, flipping out, this is gorgeous. Vauxhall England, this has come from. There's a Cresta. I love the Crestas. Blooming marvellous. Absolutely amazing. Love that. White walls. Trim, it's, it's well, just out of this world. How we manage it without a dome here, though, I have no idea. You didn't need a dome here until 76. Um, ask the driver for details. Clipper Blue, Little Blue, is that? Right. Now, there's an E type here with the shiniest spoke wheels I have ever seen. Well, they were in the sun. <laughs> Trust me, they were mint. Oh, look at that. This has got to be one of the most beautiful cars in the world, the E Type. Right, okay, crack on. Yeah, Sirocco, this is a nice Sirocco. Um, Yugo. I don't know how you got to see Yugos in Twingo, Volvo. For sale. Oh, it's really blooming is for sale. We've got a Festa an ambulance. Oh, we don't see many of them. No patients left in the vehicle overnight. No, they're in the waiting room instead. The Volvo, isn't it? Right, Sana. Mm. Oh, 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 what have we got here? Oh, my favourite. Look at that. This is the one I like. Big rear, big oval rear lights, fins. Wow. Oh. Yeah, it's pretty good. Give me a left arm to be ambidextrous. Grey over pink. Oh, smell that smell. <laughs> smell that smell. Oh. Lovely neck. Fantastic. Did I ever mention my granddad had one? 
cream, other green, chrome, badge bear, had to scrap it. Gummy rotten. Broke my hair. Oh, jag. Yeah, polish is coming out, that's serious. Uh, somebody's turned up in a Mr. Softy van, which is quite a new revolutionary. Right, we've got some uh, cars are here. Beamers. I suspect you might not be able to move for YouTube. It's for. Uh, oh, Citroen. Alright. Stylish, I think you would there. Um, that Tigra. Oh, Land Rover. Land Rover alerts. Right, what have we got here? <laughs> yep, got a winch on there. What's a, what's a, what's a tidy winch? Right, what have we got? Let's have a look. Okay, we've got uh, 82 Land Rover Series 3 109 high capacity pickup. So there you go, it's a high capacity pickup. High capacity, so that means you can get four sheep in there. Don't know. Anyway, what's this? Flipping that's a Toyota. Where to go? I see many of them about. Um, we'll give mine a, it's a, it's a lovely mini. <laughs> Got a shark in the back. Right. How's that ball star? Oh, lovely. Right. Montego. Yes, we're back on sorry ground again. Imp. Oh, Imp Californian. Mmm. That's it, that's that. What's down here? Alpine. Is that the Renault Alpine? The legendary Renault Alpine. Or is there just an Alpine? I don't know. I'm going to crack on. Right, what have we got here? Maybe it's the snail. Maybe it's the snail. This is on a Disco 2 chassis, is this? What's going on here? Maybe it's the snail. Okay. How does that work then? Right. Okay. It's got to be an extended wheelbase. Or has it? Right, so Mavis the Snail, that rings a, bit, that rings a bell. That's Mavis the Snail. Manual box as well. Good to see the roof line is still drooping. <laughs> right, anyway, that's been my day. Mavis the Snail. Well, at least he's got Land Rover on his bonnet, man, hasn't he? Right, Rover, Talbots. Yeah. Um, oh, that's an NSU. Is that? Yeah. They're getting rare. On this side, MG, um, Pleasure, Toyota. Oh, that's a nice drink. B6. Mm. <laughs> Matey the Metro. Okay. <laughs> Simca camper van. <laughs> Hello, fresh. Oh, look, guess who's here? Look, Frieda's here. Woo -hoo. Uh oh. Oh no, what have we got? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm not going to tell you on camera what Nigel said when I gave him some bumps. Well, it's probably the same as what I just thought. <laughs> so anyway, moving on, <laughs> moving on. <laughs> we come to look at this Citroen SM. <laughs> right, Citroen SM. I have no idea. Versus Alpha Montreal. I'll tell you what. Uh, I don't know. 
to be fair. Why is it so low at the back? Right, okay. Yes. Viva la France. Oh, that's nice. That's soft top Elridge uh, Merc. Yo! Uh, I've got a twin go. I've been called back because Frieda says. I've been called back because how dare he pass this by? This is not an SL. This is, this is, a, a, I think it's a 190. Oh, it's cool. No, sorry. It's, e2, it's an E220. So it's not the SL. You, you, you like the SLs. I do, but that is nice. Okay, that'll do then, would it? Yes, that is nice. <laughs> I've got to admit, that is cool. It is. I mean, look at this. It's, it's all nicely wrapped up, tidied up, and it looks, it looks like it should be down in the south of France. And it looks mint. Nice E220. Yeah, you're right, okay. That's uh, so we've seen that. Where are we now? Uh, no, we can't put that on camera. I'll have to edit that out. Right, um, another swing girl. And the Bond bug, here we are, look, a Bond bug. Comes in with a handy T shelf, which is always a winner. Now, Daimler. Mmm. Damn one. Damn, Hubnut's just driven one of these. It's worth checking out. Um, Volvo. Um, yes, Ford. BX, another BX. Okay. Well, I suppose you don't have as much to polish. Um, get some stickers on. Um, mini. I think that's a big cassette. Uh, Kadja. And an Outback. I'm not wrong with an Outback. And the Zara. Right, over here. Another Merc, another Jag. Um, yep. Oh, I don't know, the, uh, that's off top, it isn't it? Ford Focus soft top, how many soft tops is it? Well, it's hard, soft hard tops, you get me drift. Oh, Mondeo. Another Mondeo, so it must be the, must be the Mondeo section. I'm going to go carefully down here because it looks like it's been a puddle. Right, I've got to say, that's my favourite Mondeo. That just looks ace, it really does. These are cool, but that grill. Mint. Right. So it's, ah, the Lotus, we followed this in. This looks very tidy. Beautiful. Exige 410 Sport. Oh, it sounds, it sounds wonderful when it's running. Right, Daihatsu, applause. Have, round of applause, everybody, thank you. Um, Vauxhall, this doesn't look like a... Uh, is this a Monaro? It's debadged. I would say so, yes. Can you see this from the door? Uh, Monaro, the Aussie Calibre. I said, alright. Right, one there. All those. All those. Another one there. Sab table. Sab. Um, Calibra, what do we like? So this is a Calibra Calibra, and then you could have a Monero Calibra. Well, okay, bloody marvellous. 
No, there's a, there's a victor over here. Yeah, there we go. Look. Mm. <laughs> uh, he was excellent, did he? And in Austin, hey, what we got here? Tasty classics. It's two fifty. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you can buy some tasty classics merch. Because like last time, the sun is out and everyone's happy. They'll be nippy, but we don't mind that. We keep warm, we're talking. Oh, the, the weather has been causing us nightmares because obviously it's just been terrible. I came up here on Thursday, yeah. flooding, torrential rain. We yes. going, oh. <laughs> but somehow we, we managed to get lucky. But, well, the, uh, the big man's on your side, that's why. Apparently so. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's, terrible car. it's fantastic. Look, you are all here in your various guises, in your YouTube guises. Tell us where you are and how people can come and meet you. Matt, start. We are lurking over there by the fire engine, I think it is. Um, you can come and say hello to us, and we'll be there to chat. All and if you don't, if you don't, Matt is furious driving, so that's what you're looking for. Best Steph, where are you? Hello, I'm Steph from my driver classic, and the easiest way to find us is a bright yellow tent just down there. Friendship Corner being run by Ian's much better half, Carly, who's also very much involved in this. And we are all down there as well as our merch. So that's a shameless plug. If you need something new, cool to jazz up your wardrobe, come find us. And it is quite chilly, we've got hats for sale. Okay, and Ian? <laughs> uh, same, we're, we're all in the same area. So we just passed Friendship Corner. Uh, we've got our little displays as well. So that's a mix of cars we currently own and there's a couple we used to own. Excellent. So huge thanks to the owners for bringing the smart and the GSA to the uh, show. They come back, they orbit back, don't they? They do sometimes. Excellent. And uh, of course, Friendship Corner being run by Carly is, is one of the USPs of this show, isn't it? It's a place where you can come and meet, greet, chat. It's also a great place for families. They've got colouring, they've got all sorts of competitions. So go and chat to Carly at Friendship Corner. It's the yellow tent just over there. One of the things that makes Russellville really, really special. So all it's, uh, you guys need to get back out there and get, get busy. Thanks very much for coming well, on stage. Just, just, just before one more, we go, one, more, yeah. one very important thing. There is actually a side event Ooh, here. Is there? At 12 o'clock, there's going to be Brushtable. Brushtable? Uh, at the uh, Smashing Pistons Rover 200, just past our merch stands. What is Brushtable? It's apparently a chance to show off your brushes. Oh, that's so, is it a little bit strange. Is it, but art, we'll is, it a, with it. is it an art competition of some kind? <laughs> I, I don't know if it is it merit for neatness of brush, for you know, the most used brush. I don't know. I like, I like so it. Oh. Get, get your brushes out. Okay, that sounds good. Starter motor brushes. Maybe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Could be starter motor brushes. I thought you were going to say think, about the, the trail of foxes around the place. Yeah. Just to find. I think your very better half, Carly, yeah. has got more information on that down at the Friendship <laughs> Tent. So if you want to find out what brushable is, go to see Carly and she'll tell you. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, big round of applause for the people who made this happen. Thank you very much, guys. <laughs> Oh yeah, back to the show. We've got podcasting. We're going to podcasting with car chat and the passenger seat podcast. Uh, right, and um, a Ferrari. Uh, when end of life isn't, and we've got tasty classics, Kev T. A Ferrari, it was all surely not. To have a chat about the sort of cars you find in garages and in barns, the kind of cars... Well, apparently, yeah, there we go, right. In their garage classic and furious driving. Well, I don't know. 12.15, we've got Sophie's Legacy. To be fair, I really don't know. Yeah, right, okay. Yeah, we're on the Humber. We're on solid ground here. Oh, similar. I don't think that's a standard fitment V8. Right, um, okay. Any details? Side pipes. Right, well, not sure what's going on, but it's bloody marvellous. Um, Hillman.
Oh, it's um, husky. Yeah, so that'll pull your sledge, no problem. Okay, Rover, oh, well, it tends to come out. Rover. Right. Um, okay, this is the Vanden Pla section. Good to see a nice faded red car. I don't see them very often. I was back to Escort, Estate, Trido. Mm. Okay. I like them. Uh, I can't remember where I've looked in, what I haven't. Right, we're in Mayfair. Much better than Pentonville or any of the utilities. The GTS. Okay. Yeah, we're all V6 Cavalier. Do hope so. Vectra, Hermshire Vectra. With the body kit. Kia, TF. That's a nice focus, uh, ST8. Astra, well done the Astras, Peugeot, <laughs> Big Ted must have a brother, MG, MG, here, yeah. oh somebody bought a wagon, Bedford, CF250 pickup, mmm, ZT, all right, that's the Richie's Fabrication Shop. Well, okay. Sometimes you need to step away from the welder. Um, Smith and Sniff. All right, so two SLK. That's what Frida likes, the SLKs. And uh, another, oh, that's a, another Astra. Got to check this out, it's an Astra. Always check out the Astras. Marvellous. Right. D4. Um, Volvo, Volvo. Volvo, stripey Volvo. Um, yes. Design Volvo. Good turn out with Volvo Club. Well done. Right. Saab section. Mmm, Volvo, Maxi, right, lightweight, let's have a look at the lightweight. Right, what details have we got? Um, Track utility light, half two and four before over series three. Is that? Feast your eyes on that beauty. Ah, there's a Sherpa next door. That identifies as a Volvo. Panda. Panda, not only pandas. Ah, I like a panda. Some really funny ones on YouTube. Um, Muggy Miner. Oh dear, it's been here so long, it's been graffitied. <laughs> Awful, isn't it? Right, oh, nice Capri next door, look. Ah, oh, this is more like it. We've got a Lincoln. John. Oh, look at that paint. I don't know if that's coming out or not, but that's a nice, really nice metallic brown. Can't beat a Lincoln Continental. You cannot beat a Lincoln Continental. I'm just having a look. He's actually got it in that space. Good man. Good old revival sticker in. Looks mint. Absolutely blooming mint. Stripe him. 
Oh, gorgeous. Flipping out of this. Um, right, so the popper and Anglia. Never can tell the difference. Yeah. God, it's nice to see it's oily. Good, I like a nice oily engine. Stop them going rusty. Well, it is rusty for after all. Um, Porsche. And V dub. And yes. So. CV. That's nice. And Nissan soft top. Thank you. Okay. We'll go with that. And it's a rather shiny sap, to be fair. Look. Yes. Look. Um, LVS4. Mini. And here's dear old Jugs. There he is, look. Flipping out. <laughs> that bumper looks ropey. Blooming an egg. Anyway, move on. Moving on. Right, a nice little, um, yeah. Come drive it, dear, look. Um, it's not an ordinary one, it's got twin cabs. Yeah. Standard 10. Standard 10 came with twin cabs, don't know. Another SLK, Freedy likes SLKs. Right, let's uh, start a different row. It's filled up now, I don't know where to start. Um, how long have we been running now? Okay. Keep going till the battery dies. It's my motto. Right. Simpsons Classics on YouTube. Alright, that's a new one. We seem to have a mini section here. Yep. Talbot. Oh no, no, sorry, sorry. It's a Nova. What do I think of the Talbot? I think it's the colouring. 13S. Oh my neck. That's cool. Right, and next door we have a Sierra. Um, Hyundai, Beamer, TVR. Not sure. Oh, stung. Oh, that's nice. We're going to have to look around this one. This, oh, flip it out, this is great. Yeah, that's very, very good. <laughs> right, um, DS, another Citroen, VW. Right. Well, you can see in the background, it's got a fairly tall order on to try to cover this little lot. Besides, I need a wee. Red number five. Those are the original wheels. Lovely. Right. Over here. Oh, Frankie. Frankie is a mini clubman. Uh, well, then again. It's a 1990 Rover Mini City E, to be precise. And it's a 1.8 VVC Rover K series. Good effort. Nicely shoehorned in. To be fair, uh, but look what's next door. Another Astra. Uh -huh. um, Astra with a boot. It's the Belmont. There's a row. Le Mans Pontiac next door. You cannot be serious. So the new um, Belmont was a Pontiac. Seriously? 
Oh, of oh, course, GM, GM products. Uh, why not? Oh, now that's sold in America. Right, that's what we call a compact. Anyway, it's got distracted for a moment though. Let's crack on. Got some citrons here for the day out lovers. Astra. Yeah, that's good. Right, Honda. Hmm, okay. Let's hope the airbag doesn't go off. Triumph. We need mooks. Stratos. Very good, very nice. There you go. Ooh, S type. Mmm, S type. Right, look at the end. Volkswagen Golf Cabriolet. Good effort on that paint one. That is mint. Citroen S. Uh, yep. You know, I thought they were a Ford. It's not, it's a Hyundai. Oh, Citroen Sab. Another Amiga. Excellent, excellent. Two Amigas here. GLS. That's a 2.5. That's the earlier one. This is what they call pre facelift. There was a facelift and there was a pre facelift. The 2.5 was the pre facelift and it upgraded to a 2.6. Sorry about that. Right, 2.5 Amiga. I'll tell you what that looks <laughs> It's a GLS, but it looks mint. Look at those wheels. So if you've got this, well done. This is a keeper. To be fair. Oh, a KA! Actually somebody's brought a KA. Well done. We need to start saving them. We would have done with some prat. Total that was. Right, Davan. Dodgy Davan. Okay, I'm not sure what's going on with that splitter, but there we go. Okay, Dodgy Davan. Hmm. Um yes, Volvo. Yep, smart. Tatsu. Metro, everybody loves a metro. Oh. Alpha. Um, if you know your alphas, good, because I don't. Carry on. Um, Toyota style, but that's probably a starlet. I would say that's a guess. Come round the yes, it is. That's a starlet. Right, there's a Fiat. This is a multiplayer. No, I don't think so. Oh, it's a Doblo. Handy for disability wagons. Right, so, seat. Porsche. Jag. MG. Okay, not the biggest windscreen in the world, but it'll do. GTA TI. <laughs> yep. Escort. Another SD1. The rover, um, yep, rover section, Ford, Renault, oh, 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 flying pig coming in. Yeah, otherwise known as Zephyr or Zodiac, not, not entirely sure from here. Outback, the Honda, a couple of nice little minis, Riviera run. Is that something like you get when you've had a dodgy curry? Um, yes, right, okay, that's that row. Right, okay, back to a. Oh, another Berlingo. And a Toyota High Ace. And a Merc. And a Rover. Hip Sherpa. Yeah. Oh, 
like an LDV. Another Sherpa. We know them as Sherpas. Those old types. Claim P5. Right, what's this? Ah, oh, a DeSoto. Yeah, sir, I need to keep looking at the screen, not the just ogling white walls. Oh, whoa, whoa, this is nice. Jukebox grill. You cannot say fairer than that. Fairer than that. Well, you can say fairer than that. Right. Marvellous. Okay, right, where are we? Volvo. Oh, that's a nice mini. Any club in this city? And Austin Cooper, the Honda, me, Volvo, brace of Volvos, the Rocco. Oh, that's the thing, is that? Um, Tri King, Tri King. Are these based on a Jowett? Oh, look, that looks familiar. Is that engine? Oh, no, Astra. I'm doing well for Astras today. This one on a G. Six again. Yeah. Astra Merits. Mm. Hello. Um, Astra Mark 2, 84 to 91. Lovely. Right, over here. Oh boy. Come on. Right, let's crack on. TVR, Lotus, Lotus Mini, uh, Fiat, yeah, Citroen LNA, Helena, okay, Citroen Triumph, Woolsey, Mint, absolute mint. Claim, Salika, Serb. Mm. Yep. Rover twenty five. Austin A forty. I have a gold seal engine. Ooh, I'll have a seal of approval then. Well, <laughs> yeah. so, hello. A mini pickup. So look, it's a 1962 mini pickup, modified as a car rally. Yeah, what the chuff? We've got a blower on it. Where to go? Okay. It's just never an idea. You just never know what's going to crop up. Um, Coop. Honda. That'll be. I don't know. Uh, early. Good grief! It's uh, styling is. Um, yeah. Insights. Okay. Mmm, Scooby. WRX Impreza. Can't go wrong with that. So, you're to. Thingy. Okay, estate. Uh, not an estate, um, soft up. Don't see many of them. You've got to keep the ordinary stuff. Because one day it won't be ordinary. Just uh, another one day, oh, slippery character. 
nice. There's the back of that blend and player. Mm. Yeah. Um, Sierra. Yes. So it's oh another S another Astra. Another ninety-three. <laughs> and it's an S to eight. Um looks like it's about three S to eight. One plus fourteen I. It's not a bit of petrol, I'll tell you what. That is very, very tidy. This is similar to the one I have in the garage, which needs to come out. This is a petrol engine, 1.4 petrol. Mine is rotting along here. This is beautiful. Yeah, there's a bloke taking photos, I'm going to have to back off right quick here. It's an LS as well, so you get a cassette player. No, that is mint. 93 Astra Estate. Lovely. Uh, Panda, uh, Volvo, what on earth? Oh, it's 97 Sangyong Carando GLS. 2.3 twin cam petrol, 138 brake horse. Oddly enough, it's the same output power wise as mine. So, that's the early Sangyong. <sighs> no improve much. Right, uh mmm GXL Cortina Mac 3 Vinyl Roof Vinyl Seats It's a GXL Old School Ford and it's blooming nice Backquarters haven't rotted out Tidy Right um, yes looks all MG hmm and a dinky sub. Now over this side we have Beamer. Okay. Uh, Lexus. I think it's a Lexus. Um, oh yes, um, one of these um, Fiat's. That was Fiat Coupe 20, 2 litre, 20 valve turbo. Ah. Okay, well, next door there's a pink. Yes, um, oh, and the logo. Uh, Maestro. Um, Scorpio. Uh, okay, what we've got? What we've, uh, uh, for sale. Get thee behind me, Topio. Um, right, MG. Right. right, there's a Sherpa van here. Right. We're going to have to look at the instructions, and it says this is Rosie, a Freight Rover 200 series Sherpa four wheel drive. Uh, all four-wheel drive Sherpas left the factory as two-wheel drive Sherpas. The special order vehicles, which went to a company called NAM Special Vehicles. Okay. Legend has it that only 30 four-wheel Sherpas were ever built. Although it is believed that there were more. Ah, so there's not many left. You know, I thought somebody would put it together, but it's actually a proper thing. It's a factory. Right, well, that's mint. That's a keeper. <laughs> right, scimitar. Scimitar. Beamer. Beamer. Got We're back in the Toyota Starlet. Oh, no, not this to be. Sorry, Subaru Outback. What am I talking about? Right, Grover. Um, Heimers. Miranda the Heimer, not Herman. And a lovely um, coupe. 
Oh, Pinless Cooper, that's ace. Let's have a look. 90, it's a 93 uh, 320 CE. That's nice. I thought the wind has just disappeared. That's tidy. I've come for another look at Mavis the Snail. So we're to see inside Mavis the Snail. I oh, don't go around showing you your bush. That's not pampas grass. Okay. This is Mavis the Snail. Yeah. That's all you know about As if you know. <laughs> it's like sometimes when you, you stand with a camera, but if you don't press record. <laughs> oh, you did, did you? <laughs> so, all the time Why? I've been in there. Go on then. No, but it's okay. I'll, uh, I'll, I'll, I don't deserve it. Can I, can I just. Yeah, let me come out. Yeah, I couldn't believe it. I've, You've done that. I've, I've done the whole thing. Down, and I didn't press You're record on, again. Right, okay. Mavis the Snail. There's a YouTube channel dedicated to this vehicle. Um, yes, that's good. Um, uh, uh, disco, every little helps. Switch called Henry. Probably there for a Guinness. Uh, probably. Fridge, cooker. Probably the loo in there, but I'm not going to look. Um, Beaver Town. No Beaver Town. That's a, that's, a, that's a drink, I think. Right. Okay. Interesting hatch in the floor. Right. Okay. Right. We press record. We press record. Yeah. I've done a good job there. I'm going to have to read this information now on the uh, on the what's it. Right. Maybe it's a <laughs> Uh, that's unique. It's made by John Davis, 2005. Oh, I've been remapped. So, is that a stage two? No, <laughs> <laughs> no, nobody likes the sweaty snail. <laughs> well, you don't know. <laughs> uh, can, uh, turn. Oh, that's sweet. The nerd version is the inside. That's the back version. Oh, right, yeah. So this the the remap. Have you got the series ah. one or two? What? Vehicle? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This, this is a series two? Yeah, yeah, but I mean the remap on the engine. Oh, I don't know. Uh, so if you read the other one, it's all over there. Oh, OK. Because normally, you only get 138 brake horse. Yeah, it tells you everything on right, there. Right, look at the other it, one. I've got a lot of cars, so I can't remember which one's got what order. <laughs> <laughs> Good. It's got snail power. Oh, they have. They're not fast. No, they're not. Your bonnet's going like mine. It's still under three and a half ton, though. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it'll, it'll do it. It'll, it'll pull a train down. Um, ooh, there's an article here on Gale Snow. Right, we've had a remap. Um, trying to find out if it's in one or two. Ah, she was chopped in half before being stitched back together and with 30, 30 inch members in place of the chassis. And this, so it's a Discovery 130, so it is a longer wheelbase. Stage 2, oh, stage two remap. Right. Stage 2 remap, remap by a live tuning. Okay, so we uh, have military grade of heavy duty springs on the front, uh, air assisted at the back. Right, okay, so, so it's stage two remap. Um, can we, do you mind if we have a look? Or is it to have the button? Oh, oh. Well, now's mine. 
where the thing is. <laughs> oh, the, the money weighs a ton. Okay, okay. No, okay, that's a big alley uh, into cooler. I don't know why I'm doing that. But, oh, I know why I'm doing that. Right, yeah, okay. Looks just like mine. Apart from, I'm not mapped. So it's pretty pathetic, frankly. Right, okay, a big alley. So, okay, thank you. Yeah. This is the mucky end. This is uh, well. This is the most interesting end. <laughs> it's, a, it's a guy thing, I think. <laughs> right. Thank you for that. Stage two remap. Right. So that's Mavis the snail. I'm glad I've met them, and we see Mavis in the flesh, so to speak. Oh, we're, oh, now, we're now recording. Oh, Hello. maybe it's a snail. Hello. How do you? Your battery's going. Yes. <laughs> bye bye, battery. Help you there, then. <laughs> Would you like a picture with Mavis? Um, yes. Yeah. Yes. Or do you want to just be a bit of video? Um, bit of video. Let's uh, turn you around. Oh, sorry, this is new. Oh, no, it'll it turn itself. It's yeah, it that, turn that's itself. the secret, it's a gimbal. Yeah, just turn it all the way around. One, two, three. No, I won't miss it. Oh, that's it. Twenty-five. Where are you going? Right here. 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 Right me. Follow me. Follow me. Follow me. Hanging basket. Oh, lovely. <laughs> That's Mavis's lunch. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> and there she is, Mavis the snail, for future Mavis reference. I see I'm going to spare wheel on that top now, <laughs> And how am I going to get that off up there? Um, yeah, that's right. Why is it there? Well, we'd struggle. Because you need a, need a, a, a steel base for your, for your aerial. That's Very true. Yeah. yeah. I'm hoping that I won't need two at a time. Oh, well, you've got a cam reversing camera. I have. I've got two, but only one works. But don't tell everyone that. I've just and told everyone. That one doesn't squeak like mad like ours does. I've just fitted yeah. beepers to mine. Oh. And somewhere along the line, it's the second hand one. So I took it off the first car, the first lap. And it's, it just squawks like a single duck. Yeah. It sounds painful. It does. I really so. have to get a new set. Hey, it so I said like his it. birthday's coming up soon, oh, so that's a birthday. Up, so Happy birthday to you. Because I'm oh, fed up with the squeaking. We don't want to squeak your husband. <laughs> no. Thank you very much. It's been a pleasure. It's us. Thank you. Yes. Thanks for listening to the It's lovely to meet you guys. Lovely to meet you. Yeah, take care. Bye. Take care. Bye bye. Excuse my cold hand. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yes. Yeah. Oh. Right, that's maybe a snail. Well, she was great, wasn't she? Right, now, we're going, Fee's going to go back to the car. I'm going to try and finish with bat oh, um, but too late, the battery's gone. Um, <laughs> ah, but you're finished on a good note. We're finished on a good note. Yeah, okay, right. So there's, there's stuff on stage at the moment. <laughs> um, there's a flip, right? Just being sidetracked by a double over cam. Mmm. Yes, lovely. Right. A double zero garage. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> yeah. All right. We've had a look inside. Fantastic. Bloody marvel. It's a D. It's a D two with the. It's actually a D two. Yes. I saw it as I was going up that side, and then I got to that Mark One Escort. Okay, we're after Mavis the Snail, we're back into the Mayfair. And here we go, carrying on this nice little escort. Oh, Citroen van, Citroen, oh, no Cavalier.
definitely can have a bit. Oh, well, that I'll do. Citroen. Well, I'm actually going to go order. Vitesse. Um, ah, what's this then? Anybody know? Not me either. It's V6. Is that the car that gives its engine to the DeLorean by any chance? Anyway, a smart triumph. All right. Okay, it's a Mitsuka Galu 97. On, uh, Mitsuka is a Japanese car company who specializes in making distinctive models for the Japanese market. The Galu is based upon a Nissan Crew, which was popular in Japan as a taxi or police car. So there you go. It's a new it's a, yes, it's a glue. No, as I say, I haven't seen one of them before. Okay, right, anyway, crack on. Uh, let's go to the um, another smart car. Joey Cavalier. And GT, I like it. Austin Allergo, oh, lovely Mark too. Hmm. Renault. Uh, the number of the actors. Right, quick look down here, we've got a Rover Metro, obviously. Um, yes, um, then we've got Team Puss. I think we can say we have some cat fans. No, quite honestly, I haven't seen that before. Right, Maxi 1750. Do another smart. Um, I'm the Ford van. Oh, another Mondeo. Yeah. Renault TVR Muggy Miner Spider Um Mmm Skoda Right Beamer Nice Fiesta Mark 1 Let's go Ooh 73 Cortina Mark 3 16 GT Crossflow Head Very, very nicely turned out. Vinyl roof. Yeah. Okay, tasty. Very, very tasty. MG. Also rather nice uh, rover. A brace of rovers, in fact. The white van, P5. Uh, VW bus on the thingy, <laughs> different kind of Honda thingy, what's this? Yeah. 
It's like a cube. Well, an end box. Okay. Next to the end box is a sub. Another Saab, an old Saab, a Renault, Beamer, Suzuki and another Bedford van. That was quite an early Bedford van, is that? Bedford Astra van, Mark 1, with the uh, High intensity is frenched into the rear bumper. Right, well, on that note, I believe that's the lot. Or is it? Uh, then again, I might be wrong. Just in case. Um, that's the Toyota Saab, Volvo, Cavalier, uh, I think I've seen a Cavalier before. What I haven't seen before is this, or ever. <laughs> I'm losing interest, so I'll tell you what, there's a TVR here, look at that paint, is that coming out on, on camera? That is mint. What a babe. Oh, hang on. You've seen something else. Right. Right. Clues on a postcard. <laughs> yeah. Quadruple cabs and a twin cam. Fiat 500A, commonly called Topolino Little Mouse, first registered in the UK in March 37. Uh, carried a 2 litre twin cam, 180 horsepower. Oh, this should do it. Yeah, that should be fine. What can go wrong? Nice and done. Good build. Right. Well, look what we have over here. Mmm, a VX 2.3 FE Victor. That's what we've got here. Didn't have this one, I had one before it. Well, I quite have. Would have gone for 2.3. But I didn't. Right, so we've covered this row. Okay, that is Rustival 2024, Saturday 28th of September. The rain stayed away. I've got to say it's been fantastic. Even Frieda's enjoyed it. Yeah, and she don't like cars. But she's been well impressed. She found it hugely enjoyable. Have you seen a Toyota here? I've probably walked past it before, but it's quite unusual. It's this one. Ah, well, it's a Pro Box. Yeah, of course it was. Mark 3 Estate. Cortina L. 1600L. I do 1600L. Automatic. Mmm. Quite like stink, it would be great. <laughs> right, so, sorry. Yes. Okay. Now, that's me done. Battery's nearly gone again. So, I'm going to say, if you've, if you've stuck with me this, this long, Thank you. You're a blooming star. You really are. 
if you haven't I'll see you in a bit anyway uh, thanks for your company it'd be nice to talk to you hope you enjoyed it don't get lost or squashed I'll see you in a bit <laughs>